Hello everybody. This is my K98K Mauser. The German rifle of World War II. This Mauser was made at the Obendorf factory in 1944. And here it is. Not sure if you can see it. But uh, there are the markings. BYF and 44. There it is. Uh, this this Mauser is, I think it's it's a very unique and different um, rifle. Um, I have to tell you right now that it's a Mitchell Mauser. Apologize for that, but uh, I got it at a pawn shop, and um, it doesn't look and it doesn't appear like the Mitchell Mausers you see advertised in, in the NRA magazines and um, other places. Um, some of the uh, features on it are the bolt and handle and everything else are dark. Uh, they're, they're, a, they're darker. I don't I'll give you my uh, opinion on that. I'll give you my theory on that, my conspiracy theory on that. Uh, just like you don't ask me about my 9-11 theory, but, um, you know. Um, here's some uh, really, really strange stuff about this Mitchell's Mauser. Um, it has what appears to be an original sling on it. Um, this part is possibly a replacement and also over here uh, this uh, holder here seems to be replaced I don't know I'm not sure uh, most of the numbers match um, the bolt has been electro pinned uh, and has a different number on it however um, and it is uh, most of the pieces have 207 on them which um, doesn't exactly correspond with the uh, manufacturer's um, serial numbers uh, by the factory at Obendorf, the Mauser factory at Obendorf. So um, it's got uh, it's got the Waffen Nomts on it. Um, a few there's 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 two here on this side, and only one inspection this side on the on the receiver. Um, so I've seen like three on this side at, on some other Mausers that I've seen um, on YouTube, being done on YouTube. Um, it has the stamped um, barrel band here with the number on it, 207. And of course, uh, Mitchell's Mausers had to put their stamps on the barrel here with the with their serial number too um, uh, another strange thing about this Mauser is is that it is still has a varnished stock there's 207 on the on the stock so either someone took this and uh, tried to take it back to uh, what a Russian captured rifle would look like K98 or um, you know, I, I don't know, or, or it could have been that Mitchell's Mauser actually sold this rifle some years back in this condition. Um, obviously, uh, with the numbers matching on the bolt handle, safety, barrel band, um, Magazine down here, all 207. Um, but with a mitch, mismatched electro pinned um, number on the bolt, it just raises a lot of questions to me. Um, 
if somebody has any insight onto this, uh, let me know. Um, has a site cover on it right here. So, anyway, very curious, very curious. Um, uh, the site numbers, the site uh, serial numbers on down here are, are different and also up on here, up on the site itself. But um, So, I'm curious about it. Um, it's not like, uh, not like the kind that uh, you see from Mitchell Smousers and, and uh, as as of now Mitchell Smousers is sold out of all of all of their K98 Mousers anyway so um, the Russian captures so you're not going to get a a Mauser unless you find one out in the gun shop or pawn shop or, or somewhere else um, I don't know the history of this rifle at all um, so it would be interesting to find out what exactly uh, this is. It's uh, it's a Franken Mauser, possibly, or maybe a, a good good German would say Franken Mauser, Mauser. I don't know how they'd say it, but um, anyway, fun stuff. Uh, one more apology. I apologize for the. Uh, fuzzy condition of this video. I don't know what the heck is going on here. I'm filming it on my phone. So I'm not sure exactly what that's all about, but uh, thanks for watching. Uh, love it. I, I love this. I got this to, uh, I, I got this piece, um, you know, knowing that it doesn't have any real historical collector value. I mean, I'm, you know, I'm, I'm a little bit put off by that, but but not really because uh, I got this to um, add to my collection of the main World War II battle rifles of World War II. And um, I'll do a video on that a little later and, and, uh, and put that up also. Uh, I just, uh, just really wanted a, um, um, a piece to add to my collection. It's, it, it's not, um, I didn't buy it for, uh, you know, super historical uh, pieces. Once I, once I saw it was a Mitchell's Mauser, I knew that it uh, had been, uh, you know, worked over like a wearing blender, you know. So, anyway, uh, hope you hope you liked the video and have fun and shoot the shit out of things. Alright, I'll see you later. Thanks. Bye.